So Saxon course two, lesson 40, is on the sum of the angles in a triangle and angle pairs. So here it wants me to find the measure of angle A in the triangle ABC. Now we know that all of the angles added together equals 180 degrees. Okay, so I need to figure out what I have first. So I have A plus, angle A plus, angle B which is 30 degrees plus angle C, which is 90 degrees, and again you can tell because of that marking, equals 180 degrees. So A plus 120 degrees equals 180 degrees. So I'm going to subtract 120 from 180, so my angle A is going to equal 60 degrees. Okay. This next one, it wants to find the measures of angle X, angle Y, and angle Z, and then classify angle pairs as supplementary or complementary. Now remember, a supplementary angle is two angles whose sum is 180 degrees. Complementary means that the, when you add the two angles, it equals 90 degrees. Okay. So, we know that the measure of angle X has to be equal to angle X plus 50 degrees plus 90 degrees has to equal 180 degrees because that's my triangle. Okay. So X plus 140 degrees equals 180 degrees. So know that X is going to equal 40 degrees because you subtract the 140 from the 180. Alright, so we've got that one. So x equals 40 degrees, there, let's scoot that up, so x equals 40 degrees. Okay, now I need to figure out angle y and angle z. Now if you notice, angle y, angle y plus angle x equals 180 degrees, that's a straight line. Okay, so... If I have 40 degrees plus angle Y, I have to get 180 degrees. So angle Y is going to be equal to 180 degrees minus 40, which is 140 degrees. So angle Y is 140 degrees. So if I put that in. Now for angle Z, we know that if we look at angle Y and angle Z, that makes this straight line. And it's a straight line even though it's on a curve or it's at an angle, it's still a straight line. So I know that angle Y, 140 degrees, plus Z is going to equal the 180 degrees. So Z is going to be, angle Z is going to be equal to 180 degrees minus 140 degrees, which is 40 degrees. Okay, uh, the second part, it wants us to classify the pairs as supplementary or complementary. So angle X and angle Y are both supplementary angles, and angle Y and angle Z are both supplementary angles. Okay, on this next one we have a figure A, B, C, D is a parallelogram. Segment B, D divides the parallelogram into two congruent triangles. Angle C, B, D measures 40 degrees. Which other angle measures 40 degrees? So if you have two triangles that are, are congruent, which means the same, that means there are also congruent angles. So angle B here is going to be the same as angle D. Both of them are acute and they're the smallest angle. Angle C here is going to be the same as angle A up here. Okay, so the same 
So if it's CBD equals 40 degrees, then the same, the same angle that's going to measure the same is going to be ADB. ADB. Because those two angles are going to be the same. Okay, and that's it for this lesson.